Assalamu alaikum wa barakatuh. Good afternoon, my dear students. Uh, this lesson is for uh, grade 12, 5 and uh, 4. Uh, today we are going to start uh, lesson 8. Wa alaikum wa barakatuh. This is the last lesson for uh, unit 4. Uh, next week, inshallah, we are going to start unit 5. Unit 4, lesson, four, uh, lesson 8, students book page number 38. Last period we studied uh, a topic about what? About the importance of water. And uh, water, uh, poor city or uh, both, uh, water scarcity or lack of water is an environmental problem that uh, faces our world. We studied some new vocabulary. Let's do this exercise to to create uh, to fill in the space because uh, there is one is answered here. Number three, do you think that reason prevails over emotion? Now fill in the space with words so, like hurdle, while well, it's not that hurdle, implemented, intrinsic, positive prevails over number three do you think that uh, reason prevails over emotion do you think that reason have uh, an influence over emotion number one fill in the space the word cosmetics means makeup what what uh, what women bought on their face cosmetics makeup Who can answer number one? No one can answer it. Now, Muhammad Mustafa, okay, one minute, Kareem. Muhammad Mustafa, yes. Uh, there is a paucity of information on the ingredients of many cosmetics. Very good. There is a paucity. Paucity. Thank you, Muhammad Mustafa. Ibrahim Masri. I think your work. Uh... Uh, Bremit was the first uh, getting a work permit. Permit means permission. Getting a work uh, permit was the first to overcome. What do you need? Uh, what uh, What do you want to over overcome? Uh, Karim. Uh, the first hurdle to overcome. Yes, hurdle or obstacle, difficulty. Thank you. Number four. The changes to the national health system will be next year. There are some changes uh, on the national health system. Hello, uh, Kareem, yes, uh, next, Kareem Ahmed Ouda. Oh, yes. The changes to the national health system will be uh, will be uh, implemented next year. Excellent, Kareem. It will be implemented. It will be imposed or Enforce it. Thank you. Number five. Math is an part of the school curriculum. Curriculum manage. Yes, Al Masri. Abraham. Uh, intrinsic. Is an intrinsic part. Yes, intrinsic means important, basic, essential. Thank you. So our topic is about water water is a secret of life so water preservation water conservation is a major global challenge we have to keep and save water what's the importance of water give me your ideas what's the importance of water ismail zalat it keeps the, uh, the the human alive it is the main Good. source uh, to Yes. Thank you. Yes. Amir Abdul Ftah. 
امير عبد الفتاح What's the importance of water? Just the question. Look at the screen. What's the importance of water? Uh, we drink of it. We swim. We need it with for it. drinking, cooking, washing. Yes. To uh, for planting foods, yes. growing foods. Good. These are the uses of water. So the importance of water, there is no life without water. It's essential for life. People, animals, and plants can't live without it. No water, no life. So people, animals, and plants would die without water. So there is no life without water. It's essential for life. How can we save water? How can you save water? Rifat Musad. How can you save water? Rifat Musad. Abdurrahman Abla Latif. Yes, how can you save water? Yes, teacher. Yes. Save water. Abdurrahman Abla Nabi. Yes. How can you save water? We can turn off. Uh... The taps, tab. Are you the caps after we use it? Yes, good. Uh, Abdurrahman Ashraf, how can you save water? Using uh, modern ways or uh, for irrigation. Yes, using modern ways of uh, or modern system of irrigation. Good. Yes, or the By fixing old ta old taps and uh, using new farm system. Very good. So we can save water uh, in many ways. Using water wisely, fixing pipes, taking short showers, turning off taps after using water, turning off taps uh, during uh, brushing our teeth, increasing people's awareness. So we, c we should educate people to show the importance of water. Now you are going write a reply to an email about water shortage suggesting ways of consuming less water first you are going to read the letter or read the email then write a reply what is the reply what are you going to do you are going to uh, suggest different ways of consuming less water okay background information as you know that water is very important water is the foundation of life no no water no life the two main points of water scarcity are quality and quantity there is a problem with water in quality and quantity quality it means uh, some uh, some water are uh, some kinds of water are not drinkable uh, they are dirty they are full of bacteria they are not fresh and the quantity there is a lack of water, there is little rain in other parts of the world. So there are two main points of water, scarcity, the quality and the quantity. Be attached to these two points. So we have to dig for, dig wells to look for uh, water or to get fresh water. We have uh, uh, rich countries like Kuwait can build factories like desalination plants to make fresh water out of the sea. There is a, a basic need or a demand for fresh water because there is an increase of population in the world. A growing population increases the demand of, for fresh water. There are a lot of people. For a developing country, there is a lack of fresh water. We know, we knew, we know that we need fresh water in factories, in industry. So we need water for people, and we need water for factories and industry. So as bad as next, what up, Tigam at the Oh, when I said, I'm sorry. 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 I'm sorry.
It depends on the and depends on the speed of the net. It depends on the speed of the net. Yeah. So, uh, if a sort a sort a sort for the internet, أسرع من الصورة. A sort for the internet, أسرع من الصورة حسب ساعة اللي ساعة التحميل بتاعه. Now you can see the email. This email is written by Doctor Abdul Hamid. Read this email from a leading expert on water shortages. Doctor Hamid is a leading expert on water shortages. خبير في نقص المياه. Look at this uh, this spider diagram. It's incomplete. At the bottom of the email, you are going to complete it. Complete the spider diagram. Here on the next page, on the here, you are going to write what is the importance of water, ways to reduce water usage, examples of bad usage, and examples of good usage. I'll give you five minutes to read the email written by Dr. Abdul Hamid, and then fill in the spider diagram. Complete it with your own ideas. استاذ معلش وانت فاتح الصفحه بتاعت الريبورت يس مش باين يو كان سي ذا يو كان سي ذا ايميل ناو اه دلوقتي جت بتعلق ماشي شكرا استاذ اتس بيتر تو يوز يور سيرنس بوك تو سيف تايم اند تو كونسنتريت اون ذا ليسن بليز اوبن يور سيرنس بوك Don't depend on watching it or seeing it on the screen. استاذ معلش يوسف عادل بسمون مش عارف يدخل الحصه. يوسف عادل. Okay. بسمون. Yes. Ask him to uh, to try again. عبد العزيز خليل موجود عبد العزيز خليل اي سلام عبد العزيز خليل موجود سلام Dr. Hamid here has written a formal letter. He didn't use short forms or abbreviations. He used uh, formal uh, words and expressions, difficult words like unprecedented, unwarranted, consumption, spearheading. So all these what? All these are formal words. You are going to write a reply for his email suggesting how the average Kuwaiti can contribute to cutting back on water. How can we reduce our consumption of water? Let him know your ideas. Okay. First, let's start uh, listening to one of your friends reading the email. I'll ask Abdullah Mahmoud to read the first paragraph. Abdullah? Abdullah Mahmoud? Read the first paragraph, please. Uh, one of the most important issues uh, of the 21st uh, 
سنتري از ذا ستار سيتي كير سيتي اوف فريش ووتر ابو ها جون جون عبد الله اوف ووتر بريزنت ماجور هارد ليست تو هيومن ديفلوبمنت اسايد فروم fulfilling uh, fulfilling our need uh, to drink fresh water also plays an uh, intrinsic uh, role in agricultural uh, production so this paragraph talks about what about the different uses of water and the importance of water okay second paragraph yes. abrahim thank you abdullah uh, yes abrahim amdur Uh, water preservation is a major global challenge, greater development and uh, per, per, per perpetual, perpetually increasing uh, population has led to un, unprecedented, unprecedented, unprecedented demand, right. yes. demand. Uh, on all of Uh, our resources, which has uh, in turn uh, led uh, to an increase increased water shortage. Uh, this has prompted uh, Kuwait uh, into spearhead, uh, spearheading the development of the first uh, diesel nation plant. Uh, in the Middle East, as well as in be implementing se uh, several uh, studies by uh, the Kuwait uh, in Institute Institute? of uh, Institute. Institute of Scientific uh, Re Research into improving efficiency. Efficiency in the use of water for uh, agriculture. Thank you. Ismail Zalak, yes. Ultimately, we need to get. Yeah, we need to. Curtail. 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 The underwarranted consumption of water if we are. So if we are to prevail over the challenges facing Kuwait today, any suggestions about how the average Kuwaiti can contribute to cutting back on water? Please let me know your ideas. Many thanks, Dr. Abdul Hamid. Very good. Thank you. Now, what is the importance of water? Karim. Uh, water is very essential for planets and uh, for animals. Also, it's the backbone of our existence. Very good. Ways to reduce water usage. How can we reduce our water consumption? Mohammed Mustafa. Uh, using uh, sprinklers and fixing pipes. Using the sprinkles for uh, and fixing pipes. Yes. What else? Uh, yes, sir. Dia. Uh, building a new uh, new farm systems. Using modern uh, ways of modern ways of irrigation and agriculture. Good. Ah, thank you, Abdullah Mahmoud. I'm stuck. Yes. Uh, can, you give me can you give me examples of bad usage? El bad. Give me examples. How mm. people waste water? Uh, people uh, doesn't uh, turn people, off a uh, tab after yes, using uh, water. Yes, very good. Ah, thank you. 
Ah, Kareem, give me well, examples of good usage. Good uh, fixing pipes, uh, also using sprinkles, uh, and uh, taking uh, uh, taking a short uh, short pass. Oh, yes, very good. So let's see here some examples. Zambors is a father needed for life. So when you write when you write a spider diagram or when you write outline, you should write phrases. You should don't have to write full sentence. Okay, uh, needed for life. Plants require water to grow. Body needs water to, uh, to function. We need uh, we need our body for our basic needs. Required for the daily activities like cooking, uh, cleaning, washing. And examples of bad uh, usage, playing with water. Some children like playing with water, uh, wasting water, polluting the water. Examples of good usage, we use water for drinking, farming, washing, cooking, uh, fixing the pipes, etc. How to reduce water? We shouldn't, you shouldn't water water your plants in the sun because uh, the water will evaporate. Okay, you should take shorter showers for, for at least uh, for more, not more than five minutes. You should uh, fix uh, toilets and taps as they are not working well. You should turn off uh, the hoses or the taps when you don't need them. Uh, use plants that require less water. You should turn off the taps when you don't need them or when, when you brush your teeth. Here is this an, a sample of an outline. Uh, many people waste water as, assuming that water need never ends. Some people think that water will not end or will not uh, finish. Plan and write an essay of four paragraphs, 12 sentences, you stating your position, whether you are for or against wasting water with reasons. This is a topic which is different from the reply of the email. Here, the introduction, water is important for all living creatures. I am against wasting water. Uh, paragraph one, wasteful uh, use of water causes scarcity. People will have no water to drink. The shortage of water will also affect agricultural production. The shortage of water can lead to food scarcity. You should use phrases, not, uh, not full uh, complete things like this. Uh, the reasons for water scarcity, the increase in population, our selfish ways of using mod modern development, and industrialization, uh, industrialization. We need water for industry. Conclusion, we can save water by repairing uh, leaking taps and pipes, using less water while showering or washing, uh, closing taps after use. People, animals and plants need it or need water for life. People need it for drinking, washing and cooking. There is no life without water. This is what this is the first part, uh, the importance of water. And second part, ways to reduce water usage. Turn off the taps when not, uh, brushing teeth, using water wisely, using a bucket with a bath for having a shower. Uh, fixing uh, leaky toilet or taps, collecting rainwater for watering the plants and gardens. We can dig wells to get fresh water. Examples of good usage, turning off uh, dripping taps and fixing leaking taps, using buckets for washing uh, cars instead of hoses, turning off taps while brushing teeth or soaping, using energy efficient technology such as dishwasher and washing machines to use less water so using uh, energy efficient technology we can use dishwasher or washing machines to use less water examples of wasteful usage keeping water running while brushing teeth and soaping using hoses for washing cars and watering plants Dishwashers can waste too much water when it is not full, leaving the taps dripping. These, these are examples of wasteful usage. Again, this is a, a sample of a, a diagram, a spider diagram for uh, 
uh, the, uh, the topic of water. As you mentioned, why is water important? Ibrahim Mamdouh, would you like to read? Uh, we drink uh, fresh water, uh, essential for uh, plants, uh, essential for animals, the backbone of our existence. As Karim mentioned before. Good. What are uh, the different ways to reduce water? Ahmed Majdi, Abu Al Fatouh. Yes, teacher. How can we reduce water? Use it. Ways to reduce water? Making ads, making advertisements, uh, and raising people's awareness, programs and seminars. Osama Khalid, can you give me examples for good usage? No, Mr. Max. Give me examples for good usage. Uh, using uh, fixing uh, big uh, fixing bikes, uh, fixing bikes, fixing bikes using okay, Amir Muhammad. Uh, no, no, sir. Yes, give me examples for good usage. Uh, checking for uh, uh, leaks and uh, fixing them. And uh, we can also use uh, modern uh, 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 techniques yeah. for uh, irrigation. Very we can uh, turn off while we are not using them. Very good. Ahmed Osama, Hawass, give me examples for wasteful usage. Uh, not fixing bikes, uh, leaks, turning on depth soil, uh, brushing uh, or uh, shaving. Washing cars while using hoses. Good. Thanks. When you write an email, thanks. When you write an email, uh, it can be formal or informal. Formal, yeah, you should have a beginning and ending like the example on the left. You should uh, start with dear Mr. or dear Miss, dear uh, Sir. Uh, thank you for your letter. Thank you for your email. Many thanks for your letter. I'm writing to request information about. I'm writing to uh, inform you about. So you have to mention the purpose of uh, the writing. Why do you write this uh, this formal letter? I'm writing with reference to your letter. I would like to offer congratulations. I would like to offer some suggestions how to reduce water. Uh, let me congratulate you on. Let me uh, suggest some solutions i look forward to hear from you without delay i look forward to meeting you i hope to hear from you at your earliest convenience so you should start with formal uh, words like dear sir dear madam and end with or finish it with yours faithfully yours sincerely but if you are going to write a for an informal letter you write it to a friend you start with and you mention your friends, your wives, uh, dear Ahmed, dear Osama, hi there, uh, thanks for your letter or thanks for your mail. You should use informal words and you can use short forms or abbreviations. Uh, thanks for uh, writing to me. It was great to hear from you again. I'm writing to tell you about, guess what? How, how are things with you? What's up? How are you? How was your holiday? I'm sorry, I haven't written for a while. I was so busy. Uh, hope to hear from you soon. So you, you can see there are short sentences here. I hope to see, hope to see. I look forward, looking forward. He didn't say, I'm looking forward to. Looking forward to seeing you. Looking forward to hearing from you. I can't wait to meet up soon. Right back soon. Best wishes, love, all the best. So he starts with formal, uh, informal words and ends with informal, like best wishes, love from, bye, all the best. If you are going to write an informal letter to a friend. Now, I'll give you an example of the outline about 
some people are for, some people are against uh, using water in modern industries. The first is what uh, the topic sentence or the main idea here. Osama, uh, right? Ahmed Azad would like to read the first sentence. The body one. Introduction. Introduction. Yes. Water is a back home. Back. Backbone. Backbone of of people's animals and plants life. Backbone and Namud Fakri. Okay. Some people who are against. Some people who are against using water in modern industries. They argue that. Who can read? Ahmed Ayman. No, sir. Yes. Read the first body. Saeed Amabud. Saeed Lafi. Hamad Faisal. Yes, sir. Yes. Can you read the first idea? Body one. Body one. Uh, uh, this uh, was our uh, against what wasn't with her to get money no no water for uh, them domestic uh, use uh, Hamad uh, Hassan Hussein uh, yes teacher Yes, people who are against using water in modern industries, they argue that uh, wasting water uh, to gain money, they are against. Huh? Uh, because we won't have water, enough water for domestic use for our daily, our daily needs. What else? Uh, I didn't... Uh... Okay. I don't know. Really. Using water, thanks. Using water in modern industries consume a lot of uh, water. People who are for people who are for using water in industry argue that. Yes, Karim. Turning sea water into drinkable water, modern technology has be, uh, has become a must, uh, and digging water wells. So they can dig wells uh, to get uh, water. They can turn seawater into drinkable water. Uh, modern technology ha is, uh, has become a must or something is necessary. Right, conclusion here. He mentions uh, the point of view. What's your point of view, Rahim? Are you for or against using too much water in modern industries? Uh, again, you are against using too much water. Yes, here this is a, an example of uh, a topic about water. Here you can see the article is divided into paragraphs, and he starts with uh, showing the importance of water. He mentions people who are for people who are against using water in in, in uh, modern uh, industries. And then uh, he ends with his conclusion. Uh, he is against or for using water in industries. Notice that he uses what he uses some conjunctions like despite this. On the other hand, moreover, as I see in my own point of view, it is said that he ends with a he ends with a proverb or with a wisdom. Okay, Ismail Zalat, would you like to read the first paragraph? 
how the rest yes water is the backbone of people's animals and planets uh, life living things need water to live not only do we need it inside our bodies to to stay alive but there are so many animals that actually live in the water some people are for using water in modern technology industries others are against the idea of wasting water in such industries thanks a lot michael uh, yes teach uh, second paragraph please uh, those who are against uh, state that uh, most beings can go quite a while without food but none can go more than three to five days without water despite this still some people waste water in modern industries to gain money they are afraid that one day there would be no water left for domestic use in the future modern technology industries uh, consume a lot of water thanks a lot shabrakhiti no, Yes, third uh, on, the, on the other hand, those who are for a state uh, that we can use uh, water in, in modern technology. Uh, in the in the industri industri industries. Industries. Without fear, they suggest, suggest turning sea water into drinkable water uh, is the best solution to solve the problem of water. Uh, uh, sure. Sh 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 oh, city. Yes. They also suggest uh, digging, uh, digging more uh, wells. Uh, moreover, they see uh, they see that modern technology has become a must. Excellent. The conclusion, Amr Ibrahim. Amr Ibrahim. Uh. Uh, as you see, I support this uh, decreasing the use of water in modern industries. In my own point of view, we can live without modern technology, but we can never live without water. Uh, it is said that a drop of water saves a life. So, thanks a lot, Omar. So, when you write an email like this, it should uh, be informal. You should use formal words. You shouldn't write uh, using uh, abbreviations or short forms. You shouldn't write slang words. You should uh, use strong words like this. Like, and using what? Using inversion, as you see in the, in the second line. Not only do we need it inside our bodies to stay alive, but there are so many animals that actually live in the water. So use inversion when it starts with not only. Uh, you should use passive more than active in informal, informal what? In a formal letter or formal report. Uh, these are some examples for uh, reading uh, or writing about, uh, writing report about water. You can screenshot these topics so that you can get more ideas. Don't forget to do your homework. Uh, suggest ways uh, to how can we consume water uh, as we uh, you are going to write a reply for the email written by Dr. Abhamid. Okay, don't forget to write uh, an outline like this, as you mentioned before, and you don't forget to use some linkers or conjunction, con conjunctions like unfortunately, however, in contrast, moreover, furthermore, as I see in my point of view, all in all, to sum up, and of course, uh, you have to uh, reread your topic again, edit it, proofread, uh, check your spelling, uh, grammar mistakes uh, before uh, submitting your report to the teacher. Okay, thank you. I'm going to stop recording. Have you got any questions?